What's up guys, Maritime Spook here. Uh, just taping part two of my uh, salvage and copper. This is the very last little bit of copper wire I've got left. I've got, uh, you can see it there, yeah, you can see it I guess. It's really hard to see with these uh, with this camera. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I've got my last little bit there. And uh, I'm going to uh, strip the rest of the wire that I've got. And I've got some pipe. As you can see, what I've been using here is my Bell Bushcraft knife. <clears throat> now, normally you wouldn't want to think you'd use a knife for like that for peeling the rubber, but it doesn't really do anything to it. And I just wanted to have, use it for a little bit because I haven't used it in a while. That's a good knife, but I will tell you one thing about this, guys. The sheath is worth about 10 cents to me because I'm going to have to somehow modify the handle and uh, make the handle bigger because when you go to strap it on the top it'll fall, it falls right out it's fell right out like twice on me now and you can't have that and i've got it with uh as you can see some of the cord paracord wrapped around the top of it there i've got it on a uh neck knife type setup and it's just it just doesn't work in the way of handling them i want to leave the walnut handles on it the way it is but i do not want to have it falling out on me so Anyway, I've got that. I've got the pipe cutter. Uh, that's a wicked awesome tool if you're trying to uh, salvage any copper or anything like that. You can, you know, tighten it up like a clamp and then you just sort of spin it around like a wrench and it cuts it right off. So I've actually got some pipe. I'm going to go grab here shortly and cut that. But I'm just taking a couple minute break to do this video. Uh, EDC wise, I don't even know why I was carrying this one today, but. I was carrying my uh, Smith & Wesson uh, special tactical knife. That's a real good tactical blade, but it's not really good for doing anything like this. But I just happened to have it in my pocket, so I took it out. I mean, it is good for some utility stuff, but it's more uh, it's more tactical blade anyway. So I've got that. Got my little cheap multi-tool. That works awesome, and my little mag light attached to it. You guys have probably seen that, I'm sure. But anyway, beautiful day out here on the bay. Beauty, beauty, beauty. So as you can see, this is how close to the ocean I really am. Look at that right there, you spin around, and there's the stairs that go up into my place. Swing around right here, <clears throat> so it's a nice view. But you get the cold, I'll tell you that. You get the weather and the sun climbing off there, guys. That's for sure. But pros and cons, pros and cons with everything. <clears throat> Excuse me, got a bit of a cold. I probably shouldn't even be out here, but we want to get this done. It's a time of year that I'm getting kind of low on cash, so I need to get out and. You know, I've got a decent amount of copper now saved up. I've been saving it instead of just taking it and selling it bit by bit. So when I take it in, I'll have a decent chunk of change. And, uh, you know, the thing is with me is usually all the bills are caught up, but I'm just running low on pocket cash right now. So I'll take this copper in and get myself a bit of money out of that. Uh, like I said, but no, I'm going to be going out and doing some hiking here soon. All the snow is starting to go away around here, guys, and uh, that's awesome because, you know, it's it's getting the season to get out and do some stuff. I know winter winter time here, I have some stuff planned for next winter, but this winter it just never never happened. But anyway, guys, I uh, figured I'd just show you that. But if you have a chance to ever pick up one of these Bell knives, they're awesome. It's an awesome knife. It's a $12 knife. I mean... You beat the crap out of it too and it's still an awesome knife and uh if you want to use it for a signal it's like the shiniest knife i've ever seen <laughs> but anyway but the sheath <coughs> i could stick the knife right through the sheath right now and it wouldn't matter to me one bit i'm getting another sheath for this knife that sheath sucks shit sorry about my language but it does so anyway guys just want to show you that right quick and uh hope everybody's having a good or gonna have a good weekend and uh Keep your stick on the ice, fellas, and ladies.